Australia is the worst polluter in the world per head of population. In fact, if everybody on Earth lived like us, we could soon run out of the remaining oil reserves. But there is something we can all do about it, and it starts right here at home. Our electricity is some of the dirtiest in the world, with about 85% sourced from burning coal. So for every kilowatt of electricity used, we produce one kilogram of greenhouse gas emissions, which needs a massive 140 litres of water to make from a thermal power station. So, for example, if you're paying $500 a quarter on your power bill, then your yearly emissions will be a massive 3,300 kilograms of greenhouse gases and 466,000 litres of water. Add on an average of 200 kilograms of greenhouse gases for every tank of petrol and it's easy to see why Australians are caught up in a carbon intensive lifestyle. So I'm going to give you a few tips on how to save power at home. It's no new fact that halogen downlights and regular incandescent are incredibly inefficient and with an operating temperature of 400 degrees Celsius can be responsible for starting house fires. Replace your old incandescent globes with this fantastic new LED light globe. It uses 5 watts instead of 50 watts, is ultra bright and lasts a hundred times longer. With around 30% of your household energy consumed by heating water, installing a solar hot water system will save you on average about 80% of your hot water bill. And there are some attractive rebates from state to state. With our favourable climate, a lot of us use air conditioning at home and this can make up to 50% of our power bill. Now the most common unit is the reverse cycle heater and cooler and if fitted with a thermostat you can try setting it higher in summer and lower in winter. But the biggest waste of power comes from everyday appliances that are simply never switched off. Each device could still leak even when not being used. Get yourself one of these handy power mates. It tells you how much power your appliance is using and what it costs to run over a year. At the moment, it's telling me the plasma TV is drawing 27 watts of power and it's not even turned on. That's about $40 a year just for the TV. Add the rest of your appliances around the home and you're wasting a small fortune. But who could be bothered constantly switching on and off every appliance at the wall? Well, this could be the solution, the foot-powered PowerPoint. And to monitor your entire household power consumption, grab one of these. It's an effigy power meter. It connects easily to your electrical meter box, it's mobile, and records data so you can continue to improve your energy practices. You could use all the money you save on next year's family holiday. So if you're interested in buying any of these products, contact Solar Shop Australia on 1300 Sun Power or just go to the Solar Shop website.